There you go. Ain't nothing wrong with growing up poor. Being poor is cool. Because it's funny now that you look back, you know. Halloween was a trip. Halloween, we couldn't afford no Halloween costumes. Hey, kids, please. Mama sent us down to the liquor store put boxes on us. We didn't know what we were. I don't know what we are. I don't know. She didn't tell us. I think we UPS, I guess. I don't know. Let me say that every Halloween, I had the same outfit on. Every year. I just had a brown box. No, I wasn't nothing sad. I just not asked my father, could I have a new outfit? And he said, no, just wear the same one. It was just a brown box. And he just told me to tell everybody I was a UPS man. Mm -hmm. well, so what's up with you and Steve, man? I ain't nothing, I ain't nothing with me. He's, uh, well, Steve stole my material on his show, so I had a beef on that. On what show? On, when he was on his the, the, the bullshit talk show he had. And he did, he, he did all my Halloween material, one Halloween. I'm watching, uh, somebody called me and said, man, homeboy doing your material. So he did my whole Halloween run. And I know he didn't think of it. You know, this, this is true stuff that really happened to me. Mm -hmm. And so my thing is, you don't have to do that, homeboy. Yeah. Right. So, you know, motherfucker, you made enough money, bitch ass. You know? <laughs> wow. You made enough money. You did enough. You know, what? Why are you on my material? Right. You know, what's that about? You right. know, and then, you know, people want to jump up. Oh, he didn't know. He didn't steal your. So, yes, he did. Yeah. I mean, you know, so, you know. And so that, that, there's no need to, do, no one else has did that. Mm -hmm. to, so uh, this was on his talk show, which talk, was his TV talk show? His TV talk show. Okay, this was uh, the one he had on NBC just recently. Whatever, yeah. The, okay. the one that, that, damn, who took his show from him? Uh, Kelly Clarkson. How can mm. Kelly Clarkson take your show, homie? Hey, bro. Damn. Mm. You know, so, so. You got your show took by <laughs> Kelly Clarkson? You know what's crazy? Damn. Because I think that is the most lewd thing a comic can do. Yeah, yeah. to me, right. to me, because right. I step to you. Right? I'm going to step to you. You ever step to him? Yeah, step to him. What'd you say to him? Well, yeah, yeah, tell I us mean, about you know, that. Tell, ask him. Okay, I will, that, but I, we got you. Was that the first time <laughs> that had ever happened to you? Um, no. No, okay. My friend, what irritated you, you so much about Steve doing it then? Because he made it. He's, he's, okay. he's there. He's, he's on national no TV. You, got, you paid. You did your thing. You, you try to... Either you fucking with me, or you disrespecting me, or you, you know, I, I don't understand that. You're taking food out of my money, out of my, uh, you know, you're taking whatever, you know what I mean? I get what you're saying. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't, food I don't, out I don't that's I plagiarism. Right. Wow. So, I mean, so we got you here. Steve yeah. ain't here. I'll yeah. ask Steve later. What'd you say to him when, he, when you stepped Taxi. in? Taxi. Okay. Taxi. What, was it, you guys work things out? Was it still? No, I, I saw him at the, um, at the, uh, the, um, not the, um, the Def Jam 25. Oh, Def Jam, okay. So okay. when I see you, I see you. Okay. So when I see you, I step to you, no matter where we at. Right. I ain't waiting, so I step to you. Uh -huh. Jam was a shit. It was black, it was funny, it made a lot of people famous. It made a lot of people rich. It made a lot of people household names, and you know what I'm talking about. Cedric the Antenna, Kleenex, It changed comedy forever. It opened doors. People talk shit about it, and they look like damn fools years later. Now, when you look around this room,